So at the Center for Schools and Communities, I work primarily as the professional learning consultant um, to the Pennsylvania Department of Education around English language development. So um, we plan a lot of workshops, programming, and technical assistance support to school districts. But then we also do work quite a bit with families, um, state government, advocacy groups, uh, and, and after school programming and summer programming. So it's kind of like this broad array. Um, and that's what really drew me to the Center for Schools and Communities and the CSIU. Since coming to the center, Andrea was a standout employee. Um, she has always shown passion for the work that she does. She has shown consistent innovation with a high level of creativity and ongoing uh, support for uh, her fellow uh, colleagues. Um, in the pandemic, uh, when the pandemic occurred in, in 2020, Andrea uh, shifted from our in-person workshops to online workshops, training over 4,000 educators statewide um, in 10 workshops that she delivered uh, over 80 times. Uh, that level of determination uh, and insightfulness is why um, she is a, a good recipient for the Robert G. Witten Passion for Excellence Award. A lot of the work that we do is really listening to what parents have to say about their children's education, connected to what teachers are saying about children's education, connected to state policy, and bringing all the voices together to really think about the shared vision among those groups and then the work that has to happen to advance together, right, with that shared vision in mind. Andrea was one of the first people I met when I applied for a job at the center. She was part of my hiring committee. And it was amazing to get to know her at that early stage because even just answering interview questions, I was able to see that she had such a strong passion for her work here at the center. Not only to her dedication to helping to advance the education for multilingual learners, but also her dedication and commitment to the growth of the center, as well as the English language development department and she's constantly trying to innovate uh, throughout her work with the ELD program in terms of developing professional learning opportunities for educators across the state as well as offering technical assistance to a variety of stakeholders involved with English learner education. I think the work is incredibly important because at the very foundation or at the very center of the work we do are children and children's education and their futures. And as young as they are, or conscious or not, they're relying on us, right, to make, to make them have opportunities, offer them opportunities, close whatever gaps might be present in their lives for whatever reason, to ensure that they get to fulfill their dreams, right? So what I think is really important about our work, and we talk about this as a team all the time, is it's not about us. This work is like one of the most selfless jobs right that you can really do because every day every action you make is really about fulfilling someone else's dream if someone's asking for our service it's important to them and so we approach that with a sense of urgency and proceed with passion andrea has always shown a great deal of um, creativity um, she has shown that through the um, English language development work that she has done here at the center on behalf of the Pennsylvania Department of Education. Um, Andrea has always been one to strive for excellence in the work that she has done. Um, she has taken on numerous responsibilities above and beyond her official uh, English language development work. So she really has a great vision for the growth of not only the English language development program, but also the Center for Schools and Communities as a whole. And she continuously shows this vision through her work here at the center and exemplified through the professional learning calendar that she created over the last year, as well as the ELD Summit. And what's really fascinating to me about the work and our team is that there's been no time in my career that I can say I personally or with a team have felt more successful, more excellent than right now. And we did that during the time of a pandemic when nothing was familiar, nothing felt safe. 
um, and everything was new and emerging, but we just, you know, the work mattered and we were trying to connect people who wanted to be connected to solve problems that mattered. And when you take that with that sense of urgency and the passion, I think that excellence is not just an expectation, but it can become a norm. And I think that's what I value the most about the work and, and the amazing team that I am grateful to be a part of. I really enjoy working with Andrea and I'm amazed at what she can accomplish. And I'm so excited to see where she takes not only the ELD program, but the Center for Schools and Communities in the future.